lesson, we'll learn how to animate our drone using a motion study. So once you've assembled your drone and the rest of the components, we can then use the joints to ani animate our drone. So to animate our drone, we go to assemble and motion study, and it'll bring up the motion study timeline here. What we're going to do is we're going to select a revolute joint that we want to, um, to animate. And what that'll do, it'll bring up a line on our timeline here. What we can do then is we can go to the point we want to animate. So I'm going to go to 60 and I'm going to put change the angle to 1080. And that's going to make our propeller spin round. So now if I play the motion study, you can see that the propeller is spinning in the correct direction there. To add another motion study you can you just select the joint you want to animate and then you click the 60 point there again and then we put in the angle that we want to change to. This time I believe we're going to change it to minus 1080 there and what we can see that it is spinning in the correct direction. So the next thing we're going to do is we're going to add the other two propellers there as well. So I'm going to select that back joint there and do the same thing. Change the angle and we're going to select the other joint as well. Click on the point again, change the angle and then once you've got all four joints animated, you can then start to play the animation. And then you can also speed up the animation to make it look like the propellers are going really fast. And additionally, you can also replay the animation there as well by using this loop button here. And that'll keep it on a continuous loop. Going to adjust the speed there a little bit more. The most important thing to do when you're in a motion study is make sure you press OK and that will save a motion study in your browser here, which you can access later.